Welcome to the 77th Annual Golden Globes. We're here at the Beverly Hilton Hotel with the biggest names in Hollywood, many of which are actually Jewish. You have amazing lineups and reoccurring TV shows like The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel, The Kaminsky Method, and Barry. They are all returning again with lots of nominations. And then you have new shows like Russian Doll, The Politician, The Spy with Sasha Baron Cohen. These are all new shows that are showing off Jewish representation in the best way. And then you have films like Jojo Rabbit, 1917, Marriage Story. This is an amazing year to be here. We're so excited. You know, people ask sometimes if we're improvising and I go, no, we have to be word perfect. It's like the writing does most of the work for you. But I knew that they wanted her to be, you know, she lives at the top of her lungs at all times. The act is truly one of, it's, it's a life-changing role, life-changing show, experience. I feel so blessed to have been able to play this character and to be around people who love their job as much as I do. Very good, good to see you. Hello. What has been the most amazing part of kind of bringing both worlds together for you, acting and music for the politician? Um, I think just getting to utilize every tool in my belt at once, especially in something on camera, which is a, a newer world to me than, than being on stage. and just try to bring uh, my comfort level in that world to the place where my comfort level is on stage. It was, it was a great experience. Jojo might resonate with certain younger people more than, you know, than a more dramatic um, telling of the story. So I think it's great to have comedies and dramas and, you know, and musicals about all these, these sorts of subjects. We've only done three seasons, so we still love each other very, very much. <laughs> Catch us in a year. Yeah, check, check in with us uh, in 12 months. You've done everything. What haven't you done that you're really excited to do? Um, elect a president that we're really excited about and uh, to, stop the, to stop the violence and the hatred that's going on in this country and uh, particularly the kind of anti-Semitic attacks that we've had in New York City. It's nice for the Jews to be the popular kid. We're the popular kid that now. It happen very often. No, it doesn't. How are you today? Shalom. Shalom. Best moments of the show. Well, um, this second season we got to work with Paul Reiser who I've known for 30 years, a little more than 30 years, and that was really fun. I mean, working with Scorsese, Pacino, De Niro, these are guys I, I grew up watching, and next thing you know, the first day of filming, I'm doing a scene with De Niro and Pesci, and I'm flicking Pesci's uh, lapel, so I mean, it's like, it's crazy. It was unbelievable. It was a dream come true, yeah. No, I have not converted, I'm still Catholic, although my kids apparently are Jewish from, from birth, right? So, uh, although my mom, I think, uh, uh, took my, my son and got him uh, baptized secretly. What does it mean to be such a proud, awesome female Jewish woman on the show? It's so important right now. It's really, it's kind of scary what's happening, right? Out there, I mean, we're all so spoiled that we, that history is just sort of a fact, it's not an experience, and now it feels like it's circling close to home. So to have this show in the air and be beloved is so important. Anyone here, who would you take to a Shabbat dinner? Who would you love to hear from? Oh my God, that is a hilarious question. I would want to take Leonardo DiCaprio to Shabbat dinner and sit him down and Baruch Atah, I don't know, you know, the whole thing with him, and it'll be great. <laughs> I just saw Eddie Murphy over there. I think he would have fun at, sh sh at Shabbat dinner. Tarantino, Scorsese, and Phoebe Waller-Bridge. Because it's definitely happening. Yeah, uh, him and I get together every Friday night. I yeah. would like Michael Zegan to come over, but oh, I've asked him so many times. <laughs> he never <laughs> wants to come. Eddie Murphy, me, and a Shabbat dinner. Let's do it. Get your matzo balls out. Hell yeah. Well, there you have it. This has been the 77th Annual Golden Globes Awards. I mean, I can't believe we got to be in a room with some of the best filmmakers and talent. I'm so excited we got to be a part of it. See you next year. Thanks for joining us. <laughs>